welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley if you're new here. And bleh. My name is Ashley if you're new here and I'm not going to give you this feel anymore. I honestly was watching some of my videos earlier and I was like, mm, I really don't like that subscribe like kind of thing in my intro. I'm going to cut that out. If you want to subscribe, do so, whatever. Honestly, today I'm so excited. I have some items that were sent to me as I am with all my reviews and try-ons. I am 100% honest. I will always let you know if a brand has sent me items or has not. This is not per sponsored per se, but the items were sent to me. I have about five of them and I'm really excited to get to our review. Today we are reviewing Lookbook Store. And I have to honestly say Lookbook Store was so hard for me to just get out of my mouth. I don't know why, it's just, it's been one of those days for me. <laughs> and normally when brands reach out, I honestly look for as many leggings as I possibly can. I am always on the hunt for some kind of athletic wear because that's what I wear the most. So, I mean, the fact that they didn't have any leggings made me a little sad. They have jeans, and I've never really been a huge fan of jeans. Maybe I should give it a go one time. It's a good, it's a good idea, yeah. I am gonna have everything listed in the description below, as well as my measurements for your reference. Let's get to today's video, and I'm so excited to get my hands on these goodies. Due to availability and shipping, they did come in two separate packages, so not that I think you know, anyone would have an issue with that, but I just thought I would kind of throw that out there. <laughs> so you can find this brand on Amazon, and I find Amazon does tend to have a lot of brands going through their website. I'll see if they have their own designated website and not just associated with Amazon, but I will have all the information that you need in the description below. I'm still trying to figure out how I'm gonna set up my YouTube room area slash like spare bedroom because there's a huge window here, and. I really don't want people to like watch me change, but we, don't, we haven't gotten anything for it. So I'm just gonna have to do one of these. Ta -da! And starting off today's haul, I am in a pair of pajamas. I kind of wish I saved these for last because I'm not gonna want to take them off. They are in the cozy pajama set tie-dye, but these are in the pattern checkered, which makes sense. I don't know why I just did air quotes. <laughs> it is pretty obvious we have some checkered pants they're nice and comfy so as a pajama I honestly would find myself wearing these more often than not because one they match to their cute pattern and I kind of wish I got a pair for Tristan we could do some matching things so the material isn't like super super soft or anything it's not like a brush soft I'm so used to doing legging reviews so the material is 100% polyester, so it's not very soft. This is a size small, and I am usually a true size small in all, all clothes, most likely. It is not a stretchy material. There is no elastane, so you really need to make sure that you're either sizing up or getting your true size, because if this for some reason was too small, unfortunately there's no, there's no gift. Make sure you get your right size and you wouldn't have to worry about that. This would make such a cute Christmas outfit. I wish I had this during the holidays. I would have bought one for all of the family members. So nice and loose fit. The arms are, I would say they fit perfectly. If you had any longer of arms, it might feel a little awkward and tight, but thankfully around the wrist area, it is a stretchy material. So if this is an area that you do need given or want to roll up your sleeve, it does allow for that. For me, I'm going to give this an 8 out of 10. I really like the pattern. I like how the um, wrist and ankle material is stretchy, so movable. You can definitely roll up your sleeves. But a negative definitely would be that the material itself is not stretchy whatsoever, and they don't come in the most variety of sizes. So right now on their website, you can purchase this from small to extra extra large. The extra extra large is sold out. This is a size small. If you were a very petite young lady, you might be drowning in this. So just to let you know. But if you are 5'5", 125 pounds, you've got this. Okay, let's go. Hello. Oh, what beautiful sleeves this has. Okay, just one second. I need to, let me just adjust. Okay, much better. So when you have smaller, smaller breasts. You don't usually think you need a bra at most times, but when I put this shirt on, I was sadly mistaken. <laughs> so things to note, see-through. Other things to note, 
beautiful bell sleeves. I will need to give it a steam, of course, and before going out in the public, but I just took it out of the package. So everything is first impressions and try on review. You know what I can picture this going with? A nice pair of leather leggings. The Dar Daria, Daria pant. And, oh, look at this. But at the front here, you have this tie. Honestly, like I even like it without it tied at the front. I mean, call me, call me crazy, but I do like it without the tie. A little bit more. That's cute, like when it's, when it's loose and stuff like that. Genuinely, I can see myself wearing this out to a girl's night, especially after this pandemic is over. But you definitely want to be wearing an undershirt or if you don't mind wearing a new bra, your color new bra underneath, then that's awesome. Um, but it's definitely not a warm shirt whatsoever. So make sure that you are in an environment that's appropriate for its extremely thin material. This item definitely gets a, I'd say it's an eight out of 10 too. Just for it being see-through, I'm just obviously a little bit, I was a little taken back. Otherwise, I really, really enjoyed this top. I think it's beautiful. It's hard for me to say exactly what size this will be because I didn't place the order myself, so I'm not sure. I'm assuming a small based on the rest of the items that I received and what I gave my measurements to them being a small, so gonna go with a small. Because it is meant to be a looser top, I can't see there being an issue um, with, like there's just, there's just wiggle room. There's wiggle room. All right, let's move on. Okay, we've got another top for y'all and this is so beautiful. Oh my gosh, I love this drop neck. It is, okay, this is beautiful, oh my gosh. And they also sent me a skirt that I'm really tempted to try this on with. All right, first thing that I did notice, <laughs> focus actually, that this uh, front part is double lined. So it is a thinner material as well, very similar to the light blue purple top that we just talked about. Um, the material is quite thin, so it is see-through. In the back here, you might be able to see, yep, yeah, you can see my, my nude, my nude color bra. Um, but thankfully they did double line it here at the front so you won't get that. I'm gonna try it on with the skirt that I had ordered. Let me just get that. I'm always looking for a nice fitted plain black skirt. You can't really go wrong with a little black skirt in my opinion. Um, just by feeling it, it is a very stretchy material so I think that this would definitely work with multiple um, body sizes and oh my gosh. <laughs> There's underwear in here. <laughs> this is a, like a skirt. Okay, I missed. I misinterpreted this as a skirt, but it is a skirt, and I probably should have known that, but I forgot. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, the little short. <laughs> Cute though. <gasps> you know what? Oh my gosh! Sorry, I just. Got I just got so excited. When I put it on, instantly was like, holy crap, where in the hell am I gonna wear this? It's way too short, and you know what I thought of? Golf. I'm gonna have to tell Tristan, he'll be really excited because all year we were looking for some reasonably, reasonably priced golf attire for me, as I don't golf often. I really just go to have fun, hit a couple balls, and drive the cart. <laughs> so I didn't want to really invest in like premium golf clothes, but this would be perfect. It's stretchy. Let's focus, focus actually. Let's talk about the top. Right off the bat, see-through <laughs> in the back, but it's double lined in the front. And maybe even if you're going to a work event or you want it to be more business casual, just adding on a plain black blazer, you'd be totally fine. Absolutely, this is so appropriate. This is one of the reasons why I'm thinking the skort would be great for um, athletic wear, golfing environment, is because underneath the skort portion is like full underwear. It's like a bathing suit. But you've got yourself covered in the skirt, and that is what I intend to use it for. I cannot wait for the summertime. It's nice and high-waisted. Has a really nice cut across here. So you have a piece of fabric going just under, and then a nice design coming up to the side. Of course, I would 
remember and figure this out after I've opened up all those packages. These are items that aren't released. That's why, that's why that they're not on the website right now. Or maybe they are by the time that this video goes up, but they will be coming soon. I don't believe they had listed like the release date or anything like that. I'll try and see if I can figure it out or uh, I'll put it in the description if I if I do. So final thoughts on these two items is that the top is absolutely gorgeous. It will be perfect for the summer. Um, it is see-through though, so either be prepared to wear an undershirt underneath, have your colored nude bra on, um, or be wearing a blazer. Otherwise, it's absolutely work appropriate. It is very flattering. It has this beautiful scoop neck that is double lined, so you don't have to worry about the girls. And then the skirt is so perfect. I have golf written all over it, if I haven't said that enough. <laughs> Let's move on to another item. We have a beautiful and elegant black dress. I got a little scared there to be honest because I saw these, these, I always have trouble with them, especially in my bikini videos. <laughs> so this one goes this way, this one will go this way. Oh, that's simple. That's actually a lot easier than I thought it was gonna be. Ooh, I like this. Okay, if you know me in my personal life, you might know that I used to work at the Keg Steakhouse and Bar, and this is giving me all of the old school vibes when I got to pick my own dress. I definitely would have been wearing and rocking this dress my entire shift. There is a zipper in the back here, which certainly helped because I don't know if I'd be able to have gotten it on otherwise. And then they have this beautiful tie around the waist here. So it cinches it in if this didn't, if the zipper did not do that enough. This is a size small and I would say this fits me almost like a glove. There is a couple things that I do want to note here is that the sleeves, unfortunately, if you pull them out all the way to your wrist, um, you do get this huge gap of fabric. So there's just a lot of extra fabric around the armpit area. But if you kind of pull the material up closer, you can definitely prevent that. But I'm the kind of person who loves to have their sleeves like this. I am so like all the time just like cold. To be honest here, the material is definitely different than what I would consider great for a dress. It is giving me towel vibes. I'm gonna have to show you up close. But as you might be able to see, it gives you this fuzzy, it's really soft. It's a very soft material, comfortable for sure. But it's not what I would consider like a, um, a formal dress. The design of the dress is extremely formal. So beautiful, but it's so comfortable. So it works for the person who's wearing it. I just don't know how it would work in a formal setting, not in low lighting, definitely in low lighting. So you know what? The keg actually might be okay with it because it's extremely low lighting there. I don't even work there anymore. <laughs> I don't even know why I'm using them as a reference. Similar to the front here where it over crosses from one breast to the next. It's a very similar situation just along the legs here. Something I wanna note that would be very confusing if you go into the description looking for this dress and see that it's actually labeled Woman's casual long sleeve turtleneck knit long pull over sweater tunic dress. That's because they're adding a couple different dresses into the same category. So that's why if you look in my description and you're looking for this particular dress, it will come up as a turtleneck knit pullover long sleeve. But it is not a turtleneck. That's just a version of this dress. And this one is the V-cut version. So this dress comes in a size small to extra large. Um, of course, they could definitely work on having more inclusive sizing, but I would say this small, as I'm a true small, I would say this fits like a glove. If you're any smaller than my measurements, it might be large in certain areas, but because of this tie at the, at the waist, you can definitely adjust it. And now it's time to move on. Ta-da! Okay. Oh. Oh no, no. It has a, it has a uh, awkward smell. Yeah, it's, oh no. It, it smells like, it smells like my grandma's moss balls. And I'm sure the smell will be completely gone by the time I wash it. But 
I really enjoy a nice long cardigan so when you're bending over you don't have to worry about your underwear showing or lifting your arms and feeling uncomfortable and overexposed so I've always been a huge supporter of the long cardigans. This color is extremely neutral so you can almost pair it with any kind of outfit. Honestly it would even be cute with that scoot neck shirt. So it goes to just above my knee here um, and my fingertips can barely even touch it. So it's very, very full coverage-y and covers the butt. Back is plain, but then as you can see in the front, it has this like beautiful crocheted looking detail. And then on the bottom, you have this kind of trim that goes all the way around the sweater. And I'd also say it's a medium thickness, so it's not gonna keep you too, too warm. Again, one thing I would note is that when I tried it on, I noticed that the sleeves were a little bit short. And my, for my personal preference, I always prefer my sleeves to be longer than they normally would so I can either roll them up or I can hide my hands like this. So that's the only thing I would have to say about the cardigan that would be considered maybe negative. But otherwise, I honestly think it's so cute. It's such a flattering gray taupe kind of color going with everything. Honestly, I have really neutral colors to begin with, but this is something that would just pair so nicely. Ooh, and next we have one that I have paired with another skirt, but let's start with this jacket. When I instantly saw it, I thought of the Lululemon Define jacket and possibly having a reasonable dupe, reasonably priced dupe for it. So I didn't wear a shirt underneath this, so unfortunately I can't show you what it looks like without it being zipped up. But, and it's black, so it's really hard to kind of get that detail in there. But it is so flattering. I was a little disappointed at first because it was so thin. I guess because I had in my head it could be a, a Lululemon defined jacket dupe that I was expecting it to be a little bit more thick just for summer, summer use only. <laughs> um, but unless you're a runner, this would definitely be a more breathable option because it is more thin. And it looks like just the material that's been used is a breathable material, like little purposeful holes. And then we also have another sport. Um. What I realized is that I was thinking I could just pull them down, but then the skort portion um, needs to obviously fit to your, your body. So you can't really pull it down all that much or else you're gonna feel like you're wearing a diaper. So in comparison to the other skirt, I think I would reach for that one a bit more. I guess it's because the tie's at the side, it just shrinks it up a little bit too much for me. I'm going to pass on this, but I really do like this jacket. Regardless of being a little disappointed that it wasn't as thick as I wanted to, I realized if I'm working out, this would be perfect, so I have more breathable material on my body, as well as it does have those thumb holes, which I love. And as I mentioned before, I just love putting material over my hands. I don't know if it's a safety thing or like a security comforting thing, but that's just what I love to do. All right, let's move on. All right guys, that's it for today's video. If you had any questions, write in the comment section, look in the description because I will have as much information as I can provide in those areas for you. I appreciate you guys watching today's video. Let me know what you think and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.